Hi, hi. Hello. Hi, guys. Hey, how are you? Hi, Alita. Hi, Carlitos. Hi, Helen. Hello, how are you too? Pretty Hi, good. Today. Pretty, pretty good, actually. <laughs> I, was, I was listening to one of my favorite songs, so I was. Teacher, I think, I think we will finish the, the English class today very, very early because it's Friday. Huh? It's Friday. The body knows that it's Friday. No way. <laughs> Good idea. <laughs> no. Don't agree with that. Sorry. <laughs> uh huh. I know it's Friday, so I do really appreciate, guys, that you do like an extra effort to be here in a Friday's class. Normally, we do have a day off right on Fridays, but uh, since you had a long weekend last week, right? And we didn't have our class on Monday, so that's why we're going to have my art class on Friday. Uh-huh. That's right. Uh-huh. You see, Carlito. So, but next class, next week, guys, don't worry. Next week will be the regular way, okay? Monday to Thursday. So hopefully nothing happens, right? Everything is going to be okay. But in the meantime, yes, everything is going to be fine. Hey, how are you guys? Have you what do you have done today? Any news? Any interesting thing that you have done today? No? Nothing, Carlitos? No, teacher. Yes, no, no, nothing interesting. Hey, you know what? I'm so happy because, um, um, well, uh, there's it's not raining right now. No? No, no, no. no. I, I, okay. I, I live in uh, Lourdes. Uh huh. Uh, here uh, from from the morning yeah, from, in the morning from, yeah in the morning uh, until today until in the afternoon mm -hmm. here is not raining not uh, raining that's good yes. that's good does you because good because there's a time right to like the earth consumes all the water that was raining from the sky so it will uh, um, avoid um, many disasters right so that's good. You know what? My pets are really happy because finally eh, I could have the, not the time, but a chance to take them out for a walk. So Whiskey and Chestnut, they were really happy. The finally they, they went out for a walk. Yeah. You cannot imagine how happy they are. <laughs> yeah. And me too. All, all, all week they are in, in the house. Yes, Whiskey has been sleeping the whole day. <laughs> he's almost eight years, right? So he's, he's kind of a senior already. But you cannot imagine if he jumps in the, uh, on the sofa, <sighs> sleeping. He, he jumps on his bed, sleeping. He jumps on the other uh, bed, sleeping. And the other bed, sleeping. So every time that he, where, I am, and where am I, he's sleeping. No matter uh, what. Uh, and, and during the night, he, he's, they he's are oh, also. Oh. <laughs> yeah. So he's 24 7 sleepy. You know what? He takes his, um, his job very hard. But you know what? Whiskey is really um, a mouse hunter. He's mm. part of a schnauzer. So when he listens like a cat, meow, meow, it's like he's like, going and seek where's the cat or if i uh told him hey whiskey look uh find the mouse find the mouse he's like he jump in and he start looking all around until he finds the mouse and he has killed a mouse uh, yeah. yes so he's it's like a, it's like a cat right but he's a dog <laughs> <laughs> yeah but chestnut his uh his son oh my god chestnut no chestnut is the opposite way I said I, I I call him Prime Minister because basically he's like so delicate and so elegant. Oh my goodness! But he's not picky with food. He eats everything. He loves uh, green grapes. You know what green grapes are? Uh, uvas verdes, green grapes. Oh, okay. Yeah, he loves it. 
Yes, without seeds, since the means without seeds. Uh, my, my, my daughter has a, a dog, a little dog. It's mm -hmm. a French, French poodle. French poodle, okay. Yes, but uh, the, 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 the hair of the dog eat um, ice cream. Ice cream, oh, that's delicious. <laughs> yeah, actually, <laughs> Chestnut does because he's far French and also he's Maltese. Maltese in French. So, yeah, definitely. But any chance your daughter's dog doesn't drink Coke? No. No? Oh, wow. <laughs> yeah, there's some that does, actually. Yeah. And I, also I, sweet bread and coffee. Yeah. <laughs> I, 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 couldn't, I couldn't try to, 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 eat, <laughs> to, to drink a Coke. Really? I, I am thinking in there. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, try to teach him a drink. Yeah, he will definitely. I I promise because they are like that. Yes, uh, uh, French ones are the ones that they love vegetables. They love carrots. They love um, <clears throat> broccoli. They love tomato. They love cucumber. Um, but they do not love acid things. Like if I put tomato with salt and lemon, mm -mm, no. Nah. Yeah. Or like carrot salad, right? That is just like a you do like a carrot salad, and you put some lemon and and um, salt. No, they yeah. love it just the regular way. Oh, and also potato. They love potatoes. Okay, he he eat all ex ex except uh, some with acid. Yes, acid. You see, acid. They don't like it. Okay. <laughs> but whiskey, no. Whiskey is he's a terrier and a schnauzer. He's a meat lover. <laughs> mm -hmm. Zero vegetables for him. Mm -hmm. So this is a top one. But both of them love rice and uh, all things that derivated from the cow, like milk, um, fresh cheese, cream, etc. You know, and tamal de lote, lote tamal, right? They love it. But they love it with cream or cuajada. If not, they don't eat it. Can you imagine? They're so picky, right? Like the owner, como la dueña, like the owner. <laughs> hey, Jose is like, teacher, that teacher is really crazy. Yes, I am. <laughs> it's because today is oh, Friday teacher. and the body knows, right, Carlitos? Umberto, where have you been? Long time we don't see you. What happened to you yesterday? Good evening. Good evening. How are you? I'm, I'm good. What about you? I can't complain. Thanks. Thanks. You, can, you cannot complain? Okay, cool. <laughs> Have you been doing exercises, by the way? No, I was painting my house. So. Oh, really? So you became a yeah. painter. Oh, that's yeah. amazing. Okay, so <laughs> did you finish or no? Yeah. Okay, what color did you give it? Uh, like a blue, something like that. Blue, sky blue, yeah. aqua. I don't know. Aqua, yeah. Aqua. Oh, that's a pretty nice color. I love it. Oh my god! What part of the house did you paint? Uh, in the living room. The living room. Okay. No, the dining room. Ah, oh, the dining room. Oh my god, yeah. it's a romantic. Yeah. Okay. Only the dining room, or you pretend to paint the the, the all your house? No. Well, for today, it's enough. But it's enough, yeah, I know, because I it's really paint, hard. Yeah, yeah, but I have to paint other section of the house, but maybe tomorrow. Yeah, maybe tomorrow that you will have more time, right? Yeah. Yeah, hey, when you finish, you can share the pictures with us. Ah, yeah, sure. That would be nice, like Ana Mercedes, I was killing myself. <laughs> because uh, she sent like a recipe of the uh, chiles and also the chiles ones, like, oh my God. Oh, she, so sent, delicious. She, she sent something, uh, maybe guacamole? No, 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 that was Noemi. Like... That was Noemi. Noemi ah. sent the guacamole sauce recipe. Ah. Oh my God. Which is really easy, right, uh, Noemi? This is not complicated at all. Oh, and, and I have all the ingredients. <laughs> So you know what? Yeah, I will buy the hamburger and uh, I will try to make the sauce and then put it on or spread on the meat and I think it's going to taste really good. Yeah, I will try it. I promise. 
and also we'll try Anna Mercedes recipes of the chilies. Oh my goodness, that sounds all delicious. Mm. Talking about delicious, um, let me know so, I'll say something. Um, because usually when you go, for example, to a specific place, when you used to, right? Because now you cannot because of the quarantine. But um, remember, I remember when I, when my husband or my friends or my family asked me to go to the cinema. Oh my God, I was so excited about it because that is an exciting place actually. But um, I don't know, uh, we were like searching for a specific um, place or movies. I don't know if, if you do that, guys, but uh, oh, you remember, right? When you went to the movies, when you went to the cinema, right? Long time ago. Uh, did you just um, double check the newspaper or what do you do to like double check what is exactly being playing during that month? Do you understand what I'm talking about? For example, to search the movie, a movie, yeah. Right now, most of the people has a uh, what Netflix, Roku, etc. Right, most of them. But uh, an old-fashioned people like me, <laughs> yeah, and, um, yeah, and, and like me, no, I'm saying like me. <laughs> okay, we we love to to go to the cinema because uh, we love to spend time with our family. We're our friends, right? And uh, I don't know, but, but sometimes we assign a person or maybe ourselves, we were looking for uh, the movies, the movies that they were presenting during the month. So tell me guys, what about you? Do you do the same or something else? Or you don't care about which movie you were playing. You said, eh, today I wanna go to the movies, so let's go even though you don't know what play, what movies are playing. Are you like that or are you just search first? What do you do, Noemi? In my case, mm -hmm. I search mm -hmm. uh, in the well of the movie. Ah, oh, the movie theater, like Cinemark, okay. Uh, movie okay. theater, mm -hmm. yes. Okay, you, you search in advance, okay. Yes. Okay, very good. Uh, what about you, Jose? Uh, in 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 the both forms in the in the newspapers mm -hmm. and the the web in the web sites. okay uh, do you have like a prefer or um, a movie theater yeah it's it's better which one Cinemark Cinepolis is the other one right we only have two actually here in El Salvador right okay. We used to have a Spain cinema and all the stuff, but they are ready. They are ready close. That was long time ago. Mm -hmm. What about you, Anita Mercedes? Do you love to go to the cinema and watch movies there? Um, or, yes, um, friends. With friends, okay. Yes. Two years ago. Okay. And the. Reforma. Reforma. Yeah, I remember that. That was near um, yes, El Salvador yes. University? No. Yes. Yes. Yeah, right? Okay, I'm good. I'm not too bad in El Salvador geography. Okay. The Wednesday, the Wednesday was cheaper for the Ex students. Yeah, you know what? No, I think this, this is one of the cheapest movie theater that we do have here. But tell me something. Uh, well, before the quarantine, but Reforma was it still working or open or no? It closed. Yes. Yeah, right? It's open. It's yeah, open, Olguita. Okay. Yes. Okay. Yes. Okay. Okay. It's in the Galerias. Galerias is another one, right? Galerias, galerias yeah. Um, and I. It's. Um, it's. 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 Oh, my goodness. <laughs> do your best, do your best, Anita. Um, this is commercial in the Santa Tecla. Oh, la liber la That's a, I, I don't remember. The Merliot? Santa Cle Merliot. Oh, okay, okay. Yeah, I used to work there. <laughs> okay, okay, Merliot. Yes, Plaza yes, okay, Merliot. Merliot. Oh, Plaza yeah. Merliot. It used to be a cinema there. I think it was Cinemark but they close it, oh. they, they close it and they build it up, tell us. 
It was a call center, actually. Well, it is a call center because it's already it's still there, but they have no open because of the quarantine, right? The guys works from home. Yeah, but there used to be a cinema there. No anymore. Yeah. Hey, it's tell me, tough. guys, talking about cinema, talking about movies and everything, do you remember by any chance a movie that you really like? That you were excited about to see the movie? Yeah, that was really interesting. Yeah? Do you remember? Um, two uh, movies uh -huh. are no see on uh, Cinemarket. Uh-huh. Which it's ones? An, uh, it's Invictus. Invictus, okay. That was like an action movie? Um, no. no. It's, um, oh, it's, my goodness. It's, um, what kind of movie? Um, is the president of um, South Mandela. Africa? South Africa? Mandela. Oh, Nelson Mandela? Mandela? It's about Nelson yes. Mandela's life? Yeah, so so. So so? Oh, that's great. Yeah, he's, yeah, he's a really interesting guy. Yeah, I love his, his life. Well, he passed away, but he has done a lot of, a lot of things for, for his country. Yeah, that's good. Invictus. And what was the Invictus. other one? Mrs. Uh, Lang. Mrs. Lang. Mrs. Lang. Is is L O A N E. Uh huh. That was another movie. Yes. Okay. What, what what is the movie about? Talking about a woman that is a I I don't remember the name, but I I, I don't know in in English, but it's Lobista. What? Lobista. Globista? No, Lovista, L-O. Lovista. Lovista. And what is, what, is, what is that about? What is a Lovista in the Spanish? Uh, what is it? Wo she works, I, I don't know. She maybe works? She works in, um, for the company that wants to, to gain, no, to gain, no, I don't know, the Congress, in the Congress. Yes. Uh, try to approve the law. The laws. Oh, okay, okay. The law. No, 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 préstamo, ley, ley. Law. Law. Law, okay. Law. So it's lo vista, but that is from lo law? Lo vista in Spanish, but I don't, know, I, I don't know in English. But I think lo vista, it comes from uh, law, right? For rules, maybe? But in the movie, you can understand that this person is very strong. Uh -huh. And she needs to play like a chess, maybe. Really? Thinking oh. about the, 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 all the scene, the other people, the Congress, the political. <coughs> so what do you think about that movie? It's a good movie. Is it interesting? It's interesting. Exciting? Yes. Mm, you were paying attention. Okay, so how you feel uh, about that movie? How will you feel, your reaction? Was it you um, excited for that movie? Yes, yes because the person, uh, the character is very intelligent. Oh, okay. So what she all the time sing about the, the, next, and the next step. Mm, okay. All the time. Oh, okay. So you so you were you was um, basically you were uh, paying attention, right? You had to pay attention because if not, you lose it. Yes. And you, and you don't know what's yes. going on. Okay. Yes. So, so okay, yes. I like that. I love a, a kind of movies like that, but I also love a kind of movie that goes like back and forward, back and forward, like they're coming in a friend in the present, then go back, and then in the future. I love those movies because you ah, yes, be yes. really focused on that. If not, you lose it, all the drama. Yeah, I love that. I love a, a movie that calls Benjamin Button. Have you seen it? Yes. This is really nice movie. I like yes. it. Not because yes. of Brad Pitt, right? No, because of him. No way. <laughs> no, I love the the, the history about what history. about uh, exactly about that. And, and of course, I'm I'm a romantic girl, and I love cartoons. <laughs> to be honest with you, I know that I'm older person, almost forty, <laughs> but I love cartoons. I love them. I will yeah. yeah, I when my niece comes here from Costa Rica and she wants if she wants to go to the movies, she said, Auntie, there is a movie here that we're talking about, I don't know what, but it's a cartoon. 
And can you please join me? Of course, come with me and then we go together. Yeah, I love it. Yeah. What about you, uh, Umberto? What kind of movie do you like? Well, in my case, I was thinking about it and uh, I realized that my favorite uh, movie is John Wick. John Wick. Oh. Yes. Really? Okay. And what is it about? Tell us a little bit. It's, uh, it's, well, the actor is Keanu Reeves. Keanu so Reeves? My, oh, yes. Yeah, it's mm -hmm. my favorite uh, actor. actor? Okay. It's a action movie. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Is the one that play the Keanu Reeves is the one that plays the uh what was it? Uh, what's the Constantine? name? Constantine? No. Uh, that, yeah, Constantine. This, 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 this is another movie. The oh, lawyer, okay, okay. The yeah. lawyer Matrix as well, the... right? No. Yeah. The Matrix, yeah. right? Oh, okay. Actually, oh, the next the hero uh, show up the the, the other other Matrix uh, chapter really? four. Uh, chapter yeah. four. Oh, that would be nice to see. So tell me, Humberto, in your own words, how you will describe that movie? Mm. How you would describe it? What adjectives you can uh, give to that movie that you love? Mm. Well, I, I don't know. Maybe it's an amazing movie. For amazing. Example. Okay. Yeah. What else? Um, Exciting? Yeah, could be. Okay. Interesting. Yeah. What else? Mm. Relaxing? No, right? Ah. <laughs> uh, sometimes is 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 a little bit gore. Gore or bored? Yeah. And how do you say when you see a, a lot of a uh, blood? Blood. Yeah. Uh, blood oh that there's a lot of like yeah ah uh, bloody uh, i don't yeah. like it vampire <laughs> oh, no <laughs> okay the the uh, so uh, the zombie yeah the walking dead no no way. <laughs> okay so he said that um he qualifies his um favorite movie as amazing exciting and interesting so now tell me how do you feel when you when you see or when you watch that movie how do you feel what are your feelings yeah, well, in my case, I feel very happy because I like to see that kind of movie. Happy. So, do you feel in excited? Order to, to, yeah. Amuse it? What do you say? Amuse it? Uh, Amuse, like, oh, yes. Oh. What else? Hobby. Yeah. Uh, do you feel tired? No. No, never, right? Never <laughs> tired. Okay, what else? Any other feeling that you have? Annoyed? Annoyed? No? No, no, All no. All right, never, never in my life. At least not with that no. movie. Uh-huh. What else do you feel? Do you feel, a sh a, I don't know, in shocked, maybe? In shocked? Mm. With Maybe. Some yeah. Shocked. Okay. There you go. You see, we have a, a, if you can see on the chat, I have sent you the first, right? All of them are adjectives, guys. It makes it exciting. Yeah. You don't have any idea what we're talking about movies and everything, right? <laughs> no? Okay. Yeah. It's because there is a reason why. Don't worry about it. It's not because I want to know about your movies. No, it's because we're doing something else. Yeah, you know what we're going to do. We're learning grammar topic right now, you know? Yeah, and you didn't know it, right? Uh -huh, you see, you will love grammar with me. I told you, I told you. Now I want to listen to Jose Ramirez. What is your favorite um, movie, Jose? Jose? What's going on with Jose? Yes, I think he has a, a problems right now with the. Yes, okay, go ahead, Jose. No. Yes. Or no. <laughs> no, he's like back and forward, back and forward. Okay, let me check. <laughs> Helen, what about you? We're going to wait, Jose. What about you, Helen? Hi. 
So one of my favorite movies are is Pearl Pearl Harbor. Pearl Harbor. Pearl Harbor. It's a yeah. Thank Pearl you. Harbor. It's okay. The, it was like what? Oh, Pearl Harbor. Uh, yes, I know it. That is a I, history movie. Yeah, really. Nice. Difficult to pronounce. Yeah, for Pearl me, Harbor. But it's know. a really good. Yeah, Pearl Harbor. Harbor. So it's a good, really good movie and sad movie. Yes, it it's is. Sad movie. But that is but, but yes. that is the truth. What had happened hmm. with Ben yes. Affleck? With Ben, with ben Affleck. Affleck. Yes, I think. Uh -huh. Yes, she's in, oh, with Ben Affleck. By the way, you know. Uh, <laughs> yeah, you know. You see, guys, you have favorite movies, but also you have favorite actors and favorite actresses. Okay, Noemi said with Ben Affleck. Uh, Umberto said with Keanu Reeves. Uh -huh, right. Uh huh. What a. Uh, what about uh, Danny? Jan Connery. Yeah, Jan Connery. Okay. Hey, look at Anita's face. Jan <laughs> uh, zero zero seven. Oh yes, yeah, Jan Connery. Oh, but the the first one he passed away, right? Here, I think. Oh yeah, but he was really handsome. Yes. <laughs> okay, <clears throat> talking about uh, movies and actors and actresses. <laughs> what about you, Carlitos? What is your favorite movie? Uh, teacher, I think favorite movie is um, Robocop. Robocop? Yes, it's a science movie. Yes. Yeah, it's I know, for Mr. Schwarzenegger, right? Or no, ah, uh, no, 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 I'm confused. What is the name of that guide? Um, Do you remember the actor name? I, uh, to be honest with you, no, because that's a on first mega first, yeah. yeah. No, no, I, uh, I didn't remember the name, but yeah, but, either uh, was uh, it's a old it's, movie, but uh -huh, yeah, but it's I, really nice. My, my parent went to. Sorry, my parents watched to the movie mm -hmm. uh, when I was a child. Oh, you, you were a child. Oh, okay. A lot yes. of, a lot of <laughs> <laughs> no, it was yesterday. Don't worry about it. <laughs> but I, 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 I think it's a, it's a, it was a good movie. And mm -hmm. I it. Yeah. Um, and guys, and do you love to go to premieres? Premieres? You know what premieres are? Uh, estrenos, premieres? Yeah? Okay. Yes? Yes. Yes, right? They're really good when you can afford it, right? Yeah, that was really good. Um, I remember that my parents went to a premiere, but I don't remember what, it, what was the name of the movie because, because I was a little baby girl by then. Okay. That was, oof, yes, Carlitos, that was a long time ago as well. <laughs> okay. Um, Danny, what about you? What is your favorite movie and a favorite actor? Danny, hey Danny, hello. hello. Sorry. <laughs> okay, I was like Houston. Do we have a problem? Yeah. <laughs> no, um, my favorite movie. Well, my favorite movie are uh, Disney's movies. Disney's movie. Yay! Yes, okay. <laughs> I really love Princess and, and all oh, of that. okay, like Cinderella, right? Snow White. Yes. Okay, Little Mermaid, etc. Okay. Exactly. Oh. And High School Musical too. <laughs> high School Musical as well. Mm -hmm. hey, Danny, how old are you, by the way? Twenty-five. <laughs> ah, five. ah, okay. You're a baby girl. Okay, I understand that. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. 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 But I know because my favorite cartoon is Mr. Tigger. Do you were oh. in Winnie Pooh? Yeah, yes. you know, my hus my husband is Winnie Pooh because that's the way that's the way he is, and I'm Tigger because I have a lot of energy. Yeah, that you that you already know, right? Mm -hmm. <laughs> okay, very I good, know, Danny. Excuse me, I know this translate los pica piedra. The Flintstones. Oh, very, very. Ooh, yeah, oh. but they're really nice, and they're a movie. There is a movie, right? The Flintstones. Yes, that movie. No, but you love it's the cartoons. Okay, the original was from Hanna Barbera. Yes. Okay, very uh, good. The Los Espaciales. Oh no 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 Jetsons no. the Jetsons the, the Jetsons the Jetsons yes I love it. The Thundercats. Oh yeah, I was a snarf. <laughs> no, just kidding. <laughs> yeah, because I was the youngest in my family, so that's why. Okay, very good. Uh, Wendy, what about you? Tell us about your favorite movie and your favorite actor or actress. 
I love the movies of Harry Potter. You you love horror movies? No, Harry Potter movies. Harry Potter movies, okay. Yes, I love The Magician, but also I love uh, The Notebook. Romantic. The Notebook, okay. Aww. And my favorite actor is Brian Gosling. Brian Gosling. Oh, okay. Oh, that's good. You know, let me say, yeah, way to go, way to go. Ryan, yes. <clears throat> okay, Olguita, now that you spoke, <laughs> tell us a little bit about your favorite movie and your favorite actor or actress. My favorite movie, uh, The Proposal with The Proposal? Sandra Bullock. With, Sa uh, with yes, Sandra Bullock? Proposal. Okay. Yes. Yeah, she's a great actress. The, the, one of the best actresses. Yeah, uh, definitely. John Wick too. John what? John Wick. Oh, John Wick? Okay. One, two, one, two and three. <laughs> All right. One, two, uh, and three. Okay. Eh, también. Also? Um, oh, también. Also. also? Okay. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. <laughs> Spanish. No way. Yeah. With you, no. It's not allowed with Spanish anymore. Ha, huh, come on. Uh -huh. Yes. Also, the be one of the best uh, actor, uh, Jim Carrey. Jim Carrey. Yeah, I love Jim Carrey. Ken Yes, Ken Reeves, Ryan Gosling. Okay. Um, maybe Johnny Depp. Johnny Depp? Oh, yeah, I love him. <laughs> In the Paris, yeah. pa Paris of Caribbean. Yes, I love it. <laughs> yes. Yeah, very good. Uh, Blue Sky as well. Oh, very good. You have a lot of actors and actresses that you like. That's good. Yes. Yeah, so be because yes. of mm -hmm. when you go to the cinema, you have a lot of choices, right? Yeah, very good. Yes. Yeah, that's good. Thank you so much for sharing, Olguita. Let me check. Uh, who's missing? Who's missing? Adela. What about you? We're hello. talking. Hey, hello. We're talking, Adela, about our favorite movie and our favorite actor or actress. Oh, okay. Mm -hmm. My favorite actor is um, Anthony Hawkins. Anthony Hawkins. <laughs> yeah. Yay. Yeah, I love uh, it. All movies, but. I like I I like to view with uh, to watch when with my husband with your husband okay <laughs> but it's your favorite uh, Anthony Hopkins movie um, the silent no of blacks no <laughs> <laughs> no uh, oh, no I, mean. I don't and this the I know sense of silence. I know sense silence. What? The silence of oh, the silence. Uh, the silence of the innocents. Yes. Ah, okay, is. okay, <laughs> okay. Yeah. Oh my God, that was like uh, that is a really. He, he not remember, but um. Yeah. I I watched one movie. The the. Star the the life of oh, oh this person this this person in this movie mm -hmm. in Hannibal Lecter Hannibal Hannibal I Lecter. know I don't like him no <laughs> that one no way I love no, I don't like it yeah he did yes, a, he? They, yeah they said that he did a really good job on that but, but no that one no way he, he, only once I I watched the um, Dr. Chivago oh, with Dr. my husband Dr. Chivago that was a like, uh, old movie right Carlito that was an old my movie, husband <laughs> but my husband say that I get get him and uh, I fall because it's very <laughs> la <laughs> all all uh, what is uh, around four four hours. Four hours? Yeah, four a yes, I know. Have you have? Do you remember the the sunflowers of Rosha? Have you seen it that? The sunflowers of Russia? No. Los girasoles ah. of Russia? The Russia? Ah, yes. That's a really uh, pretty nice but one. But this is a 
el topic o Lara. O exactly, Lara. exactly, exactly. Yeah, you see? And, and Humberto <laughs> said, what we were talking about all this, it's because of a reason. Okay, now, now if Humberto is going to fall asleep, because he doesn't understand what we're talking about movies and actors and actors. <laughs> it's boring. This. It's like, it's boring. <laughs> especially when we're talking about Dr. Shivago, like, what is that? And yeah, you know, he was not, it was, he wasn't born when that happened. Me, neither do I, okay, Ronald? I'm not too old, so neither do I. But we're talking about that. And also, I ask you about adjectives and everything because, guys, and when we are talking about um, things that we like, for example, uh, actresses, books, or movies, uh, we use one word that you already know, but I want you to just remember that. And there are participles. You remember that? Do you remember the participles? Yes or no? Yes? Participles, yes. Normally, guys, the participles, eh, those are verbs, right? Verbs. Verbs, yes. And the participle, guys, all the verbs that they ended up with ED. Like, for example, eh, Humberto said excited, tired, interested, yeah? Those are participles. But guys, there is another way to use participles besides verb. And what is it? We can use participles as an adjective. And that's what you have done right now. When you were talking about how you feel when you watch that movie, or when you're talking about or described the characteristics of that movie, you were using participles, but guys, no as an adverse. You were using participles as an adjectives. You see, that's really interesting, right? Is it the first time that you listen to that? Yeah, Did you see? Participles, guys, we can use it in two ways. We can use it as the verbs that we would normally use, but we also can use them as an adjectives. But guys, we have, today we're go, we have used two type of um, participles. We have used pa present participles and we have used past participles. We're going to talk about them and we're going to learn a little bit about the use of each other, okay? But it's really interesting. You see, interesting. That is a participle in present. <laughs> yeah, and interested participle in past. You see, you can use them both. And right now you have used both to describe your movie and describe how you feel. But tell me something, since we use, or we can use the participles as an adjective as well, do you guys remember what is an adjective, by the way? What is an adjective, guys? Oh, mm -hmm. Can somebody give me an idea and help me? What is an adjective? How can you describe an adjective? Is used for describe something. Exactly. Very good, Danny. An adjective used to describe something. Like what? Like what? Happy? No, no, I mean, I mean, uh, describes what? Adjective describes what? People, Feeling? people, Feeling? people Feeling? Things, animals, food. Animals, food. A food could be like things. Things. Places, right? Okay, exactly. So adjectives and all of them, guys. Places, uh, people, animals, etc. How do you call that in a grammar way? What are they? What are they? Are there adjectives? Are they adverse, verse, or they are nouns? No. Nouns, exactly. So remember, guys, that adjectives describes noun. For example, beautiful girl, right? In that sentence, beautiful girl, what is a noun? Girl. Girl. And what is an adjective? Beautiful. Beautiful, beautiful. exactly. Okay. Uh, for example, 
A interesting book. What is a noun? Book. book. And what is an adjective? Interesting. interesting. Exactly. Interesting. The, but that, guys, that adjective, the adjective interesting is you are using that word, you are using present participle. So if, for example, an adjective describes a noun, also, guys, when you're using participles as an adjective, they are also going to describe the nouns. Okay? They are going to do exactly the same function as an adjective. Would you like it? Would you like to see it in context? How you use both? Yes. yes? Okay. Yes. So right yes. now, what I want you to do is to listen carefully about. A, basically, it will be a dialogue about two friends. About two friends that they are planning to do what we were talking, going to the cinema, and they don't know what movie uh, they would like to to see. So they're like making plans. Okay, about it. So I just want you guys to pay attention on how they use both. The participles, the particles in present pa present participles and past participles. After that, we're going to discuss the dialogue and then we're going to study deeply those participles. Okay, so allow me just a couple of minutes and then I will let you know where is it? Where is it? Where is it? There you go. I think it's here. There you go. Let me check. Let me check something before I share right now my screen with you. I was listening. I was listening. So uh, there you go. I was listening some French uh, <laughs> songs. So I apologize for that. There you go. Okay, okay, guys, listen to your dialogue, please. I will play the dialogue only one time. Okay, only one. So pay attention. Playing, part A. Listen and practice. Do you want to see a movie tonight? Maybe. What's playing? How about the new James Bond film? I hear it's really exciting. Mm. Actually, the last one was boring. What about the movie based on Stephen King's new novel? I don't know. His books are usually fascinating, but I don't like horror movies. Well, what do you want to see? I'm interested in the new Halle Berry movie. It looks good. That's fine with me. She's a wonderful actress. Okay, guys, tell me what they are talking about. I did not listen. It's um, going to the movies. Going to the movies. Right. Yes, going to the movies, exactly. Now tell me, guys, uh, what's playing? ¿Qué está pasando? What's playing in the, in the, in the movie theater? ¿Qué están exhibiendo? What's playing? A new James Bond film. Uh -huh. Ay, Anita, because you love the actor, right? <laughs> Excuse me. Okay, very good. Exactly. E, do you remember, guys, how she describes that movie? What was hmm? the adjective that she used? No? Bore. Uh, no. The last, was bore. Uh, the last one bore. was bore or boring? Boring. 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 Very good. Okay. And there was another another movie, but that movie was based on a new novel. What was the movie about? It's about Stephen King. King. Stephen King. Stephen King is a British uh, writer. He's really good. But what type of novel that he writes? Drama. Horror. 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 Exactly. Horror. Exactly. So how she expressed herself about the book? What was the adjective that she used? Fascinating. Fascinating. Mm -hmm. Very good. Oh, and last and last but not least, she also mentions about a favorite actress. What is the name of her favorite actress? Halle Berry. Halle Berry movie. All righty. And how she describes her wonderful just a wonderful okay so you would would you like to know uh, if they decide to go to the movie or what okay what decision they made okay let's continue listening to the conversation you said that they don't you you don't hear it you said let me put it a little bit louder okay let's listen to the rest of the conversation okay now that you have listened to the conversation tell me what happens next what do they decide to do? Write it on our discussion box. Yeah, her last movie was especially good. It's probably one of my favorites of all time. 
Actually, I didn't see that, but I heard it was just okay. Well, I'll call the theater and find out what time the movie starts. Hello? Could you tell me what time the new Halle Berry movie is playing tonight? I'm sorry. The Halle Berry movie closed last time. Oh, really? Oh, okay. Thanks. You won't believe it. It's not showing anymore. It just finished playing last night. Oh, no. I guess we're back where we started. Why don't we just see what's on TV tonight? That... Okay, guys, so what happened? Which movie they decide to go or to watch? Which movie? The movie, the Halle Berry. Halle Berry, exactly. And they were so excited, so excited about it, right? And then what, what happened next? She called the theater. The movie theater. And she figured it yeah. out. She found out what? What time is playing the, the movie? The movie. What time the movie was playing. But what happened with the movie? It was closed. Well, it was closed. Okay. They did not play the movie anymore, right? Oh, yes. my God. So she got, she was so uh, excited about it. But finally it was like, Ugh. okay. So what happened next? What did they decide to do at the end? Watch TV. They watch TV. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Netflix, right? Well, I don't know. Raghu, whatever, right? Yeah. All right. So, guys. The mentalist. Hey, oh, my God. Oh, come on, Adela. What's going on with Serious. you? Serious. Uh, all right. Okay. Oh, my God. I don't know what Adela is thinking. She, or, she has not um, had her um, dinner right now, right? I'm <laughs> just kidding. Uh, but, but Humberto, yes, he was drinking his seven up, you know? Mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah, you, decide, you, de you deserve it because you were thirsty and it, because you did a really uh, a lot of physical ex yeah, exercises. I know, so very good. <laughs> okay, guys, so do you notice how they use the participles when they were describing uh, the movies and when they were describing the persons or the books, right? So now, guys, let's focus and let's learn more deeply the use of the, uh, the past participles and the present participles as an adjectives, okay? And then I will send, I will, we're going to do like a writing exercise at the end, okay? So bear with me for a moment. Any questions so far? Is it good? Okay. No comments. So I think everything is okay, hopefully. <laughs> All right, very good. Okay, do me a favor. Can you see it? Or would you yes. like me to make it bigger? Yes. No? Yes. Okay, let me put it a little bit bigger. This is the one that we have seen, so no way, no way. Okay, guys, so the participles. We're going to see the participles as an adjectives. We're going to see the present ones and the past ones, okay? As we already discussed, the participle as an adjective works exactly the same function of a regular adjective describes the noun but i want you guys to pay attention of what is the form of the present participle and what is the form of the past participle guys you can use exactly one adjective in both ways but the emphasis it will be different so uh just pay attention to the, to the examples okay okay let me give you the first example who can help me read it umberto thank you umberto Stephen King's books are fascinating. Fascinating. Very good. Okay, tell me, in that particular sentence, guys, what are we talking about? We're talking about Stephen King's books or we're talking about the books? The books. The books, the books of Stephen King, right? Okay. And what we are saying about the books? They are fascinating. They are fascinating. They are fascinating. Okay, very good. Uh, uh, this Anita, you're going to help me read the seconds because I know that you love Mr. James Bond. So do me a favor, <laughs> read the second line, please. The second sentence. The last James Bond film was boring. Okay, yes. Guys, in that sentence, well, we're talking about James Bond or we're talking about the film of James Bond? The film, the film. The film. Mm -hmm. of James Bond. Film. Exactly. And, and what was the adjective that we gave to that film? Boring. 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 Is it positive or negative? 
Negative. 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 Exactly. And the last one, eh, 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 eh. no, Amy, the last one, please. Uh, the new Halle Berry movie sounds interesting. Interesting. Very good. Uh, interesting. Yes. Very good, uh, Noemi. Are we talking about Halle, movie, Halle Berry or we're talking about the movie of Halle Berry? The movie. The, the movie. movie of Halle Berry. The sound the movie. Exactly. So if you take a look, guys, of these ones, let me put it here. Yes. The nouns here will be the book, right? That he, the second one will be the film, film, and the third one will be the movie, movie. right? Um, okay, so guys, with the present participle, we give the emphasis to the noun, and if you can see that, we just use the verb. What is the verb here? The verb is fascinated, right? Fascinated, but since we're using present participle, we're going to use the ing form, okay with present participle as an adjective, okay? Talking about adjectives of participles as an adjectives, okay? So here, guys, what is the verb here? What is the verb of boring? What is the verb? Bored. Bored, okay? But since we're describing the film and we're using participle as, a, as an adjective, we're going to use boring, okay? And, and the last uh, verb, what is the verb here? Interesting is the adjective, but what is the verb? Sounds. Uh huh. Interested. That's the verb. So, but this one we're using the participle, the regular way that we use it an adjective, an adver, a verb. Sorry. Well, now we're using it as an adjective. So, if we're going to use it as an adjective, we're going to add the ing form of the verb. Okay. So you see how we use the participle as an adjective? Do you, do you understand that? Yes? Jose, Dani. In the, in the second sentence. Who, uh, uh, Carlitos, yes, go ahead. Uh, the, uh, the last James Bond, Bond film was, mm -hmm. was boring, is in the past. Yes. Okay. It's, it's in the past the verb, but know the know the 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 participle. Okay. 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 Mm -hmm. Exactly. Very Thank good. You. You're welcome. Now, guys, do me a favor. Let's talk about the past participles. Let me go back and click on it because I want you to pay attention on this one. There you go. Oh, okay, here. Let me check here. There you go. Let me move you here. Okay, guys. Now we have the past participles. In this case, guys, we use, you see, the ED. Like the example of uh, the uh, Umberto gave us, right? How he felt when he sees his, uh, when he watches his um, favorite movie. He said that he feels interested, right? That, what is your favorite movie, Umberto? John Wick, teacher. John Wick, okay. So you Wick, you are fascinated with that, right? You're fascinated. Okay, so do me a favor. Read for me the first sentence, please. I am fascinated by Stephen King books. A Stephen King or Stephen King's book? A Stephen, a Stephen King's. Aha, uh -huh. very good. Excellent. Adela, can you please read uh, the second sentence for me? Okay. I was bored by the last James Bond film. Very good. And the last but not least, Carlitos, can you please read for me the last sentence? I'm interested in the new Halle Berry movie. Very good. I'm interested. Very good. Okay, guys. So take a look at these three sentences and tell me. Okay, we have here the, the adjective, right? The adjective or the participles, but in the past, making the function of an adjective. So in this case, we have fascinated, we have bored, and we have interested. Now, guys, these verbs are emphasized here, or these verbs gives the emphasis to the person who's feeling. Person. 
was exactly the person, the, person, yeah. the person who's feeling the emotions. So in this case, guys, when you're talking about participle as an adjective, but using the past participles, the adjective is not, it doesn't have to be anything with the, with the book, for example, in this case, it's Stephen King's book, with the film or with an actress. It has to be or expresses the emotions of the person who is talking, okay? Do you, do you understand right now? Is it clear you have a doubt? I will give you more, more examples. Don't worry about it. But right now, I want to know if you uh, have questions. Doubts. Go ahead. Teacher. Olguita in, or Noemi? No. no Adela. Adela. In okay, this, thank you, Adela. In the second sentence, I was born, but the last change mm -hmm. is I think mm -hmm. the is refer to, to last. No, the actor. No, it doesn't because, have. Uh -huh. Go ahead, go ahead, go ahead. Because, because say the last, the last James Bond film. Uh huh. Yes, but to, if you if you if you take a look at the sentence, Adelita, eh, the sentence says, "I was bored." Who was bored? Mm -hmm. eh, the eh, James eh, Bond film, film or, 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 or myself? No, no. Myself, myself. Yeah, exactly yourself exactly uh -huh. so you said i was bored by the james film but if you take a look uh let me check uh exactly the same sentence but using present participle with the ing form the last james bond film was boring that adjective was qualifying not me was qualifying james bond film Okay? Yes. Exactly. Yeah. But this, the, this one in the past participle, the, the oh. participle board, which is in the past, it doesn't qualify the James Bond film. It qualifies the person who is expressing that emotion. Uh, okay. Uh -huh. You see what is yes. the difference? Okay, so when yes. present participle puts the emphasis of the thing that, that is describing but past participle puts emphasis of the person who's expressing his or her emotions. Okay? Oh, okay. Mm -hmm. The subject. Exactly. Very good. Okay, thank you. You're welcome. No, I know. You know. You see, you're really smart. I told you. Yeah, you are. Okay. Very good, guys. Oh, that's a little baby. Okay. Let me give you an example. Can you see it, guys? Yes? Yes. Okay. Very good. Okay, guys. Uh, we're going to use here. Uh, let me give you an example of a participle as an adjective to describe the noun. Okay. Uh, what is the uh, participle that we're using right now? Who can tell me? Exciting, right? Exciting. Exciting. Exactly. Hey, we use it exciting in present participle or past participle? Present. 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 Why? Because we have an ING form here. Exactly. Very good. That's what I put it in a different color. Okay, take a look. Uh, Jose, do me a favor. Can you please help me read the example? Okay. The white cat was exciting to watch. Okay, the white cat, very good, was exciting to watch. What is the noun there? Cut. The cat. Cut. And what is the past, the participle there? Exciting. Exciting, right? Exciting. Mm -hmm. Yeah, we were talking about no me that was uh, watching the cat. Yes. No, uh, we're talking about cat. that animal yeah, that it was fascinating or exciting to watch. Very good. Let me check. Okay. Now, guys, take a look at this part. Okay, guys, in present participle, we add the ing form. For example, the verb is excited, but if we would like to use it in present participle, will be exciting. In the past participle, we need to add the ed. If we would like to use the same one, the same one, but it's in past participle, will be excited. The film is exciting, but I 
feel excited when I watch it. ¿Sí? ¿Ven la diferencia? The film is exciting. You're describing the field, the theme. But you said, I feel excited every time that I, that I watch a John Wick movie, for example. ¿Sí? You see the difference, Humberto? You got it? Yeah? Yeah. You said not complicated. All that you want, that you have to do is to think, think. Present participle, I-N-G. Past participle, E-D. Present participle, emphasize the things. Past participle, emphasize the feeling of the person who's talking. You see? Yeah. Very good. Okay, guys. I got it here. You see? I um, have it here, an example. ING describes a noun. noun. ED describes feelings of a noun. You see? For example, the first one, the cat was exciting to, to, to see. What was the noun? The cat, right? And what was describing? That was exciting to see. Uh -huh. But if I said, I was excited to see the cat, or to watch the cat, it is describing my feelings. What is the noun in that sentence? I was excited. What was the noun? What is the noun there, guys? Excited. No, the noun. I. I. Exactly. So that said, I was excited. That word, excited, that is a past participle, describes my feelings when I watch the little cat. You see? Yes. Okay, very good. And let me go back. You see, there's another example here. The museum is interesting. I am interested. Work is tiring. I'm tired. Yeah? The movie is exciting. I am excited. Ven la diferencia? You can check the difference? Okay, now is your turn. Pero time is over, right? Ah, yes, teacher. We, we, we would like to participate, teacher. We would like to do the exercise that you're about to give us, teacher. But you know what? It's time is over and there's nothing else that we can do. Yes, there is. Okay, so since you are so really smart and I'm really nice teaching, you're really nice students, I will give you that exercise for you to practice at home. Okay, ah, so no, yes, Anita, with me always will be something to do. Not like, oh, yes, yeah, we're going to have free time. No way, guys, no way, not with me. Because you, if you practice, you will never forget it. But if you do not yes. practice, that's going to be a disaster. Okay, so I'm going to send it to you to the WhatsApp and just let me know, guys, if you got that, okay, if you receive it. Tell me as long as you're able to receive it. <laughs> Once you receive it, I'm good. But right now, no. Guys, there will be one, uh, one two, three, four, five, six uh, burps that maybe they're brand new for you. Maybe. Maybe yes, maybe not. So my best recommendation will be that before you start uh, doing the exercise, try to take a look um, on the dictionary and find out uh, what does it mean, okay? What are the meaning of, uh, of those? There you go. I think uh, we're having a problem about connections right now. I don't know what's going on here. Well, anyway. Let me check if I can send you something right no now, guys. Homework. Uh, no, of course there will be a homework. Mm. It's a red. Yeah, ah, uh, yes. Israel so. alert. Uh, Israel alert, come on. <laughs> no, 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 no. There will always be a homework with me. So bear with me for a moment and I will send it to you. Okay, there you go. You have the homework already. <laughs> ha, you will say that you're not going to have a homework. Mm -hmm. Not with me, guys. I told you, not with me. Do you have a guy? Do you receive it? No. 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 Not yet. No yet. No yet. 
Ah, ok. Yeah. I, will, I will do something right now. Uh -huh. Wait a minute. I'm not going to let you go, guys, until you receive it. Don't worry about it. You, did you receive oh, it? That is. Yes. Yeah, you see? Yes, I got Everybody it. Everybody like, yes. <laughs> I know that you're so happy to practice at home, right? Yes. <laughs> okay, guys, thank you so much for being in today's class to do an extra effort, to go an extra mile. I love to see you. I'm so happy to see you. I wish you the best. Please stay safe, okay? I hope so. Yes, please, because I want to see you on Monday, okay? So, hugs and kisses. Go to have dinner, Humberto. <laughs> Just kidding. <laughs> All right. Bye-bye. Take care. Bye. Great weekend, guys. Bye. Good Bye. Night. Bye.